I feel like a cyborg. Here you go, you're a proud member now. Indeed, part of the club. Just like that, I was part of a small group of people on Earth pushing the boundaries of what it means to be human. And within minutes, I was meeting with their tech team to get my chip programmed. I guess what you're saying, to sort of put it in layman's terms, if I, I wouldn't need to take this out until we live in that futuristic world where everything's wireless, cash is gone, autonomous vehicles take us everywhere, and I'm just beeping my way through my day. Really, probably you'd never have to take it out, and this is what we think is gonna propel us into that next stage in life, the cashless society like they're doing overseas already. This would facilitate that because you wouldn't need to carry any cards or cash. Everything would literally be stored on the chip. There is no GPS tracker in the chip, which was really good to know. And the applications for it were actually pretty sweet. I could now open doors, fire off texts, forget all of my passwords, and even make credit card payments. I started to wonder, is it worth getting this thing removed? And what I'll do is I'll set yours up so that I can make a phone call off of it right now. Success. Stuck in this internal debate about whether to keep the chip, I thought I'd talk to some employees to get their take. One who has the chip and another who opted out. You know, I wasn't opposed to it, but they had so many people that wanted the chip that I felt I would just wait for a few months and see how everybody reacted to it, if anybody got sick from it, anybody yeah. got infections, you know, you know, any of that stuff. And it's everybody that has gotten one has been just doing just fine on it. You got chipped on your very first day. I guess the number one question I have is why? Like, why did you feel you had to do it besides seeing everyone else? So I found out through social media that the company that I was moving from Colorado to come to Wisconsin to work uh, was optionally microchipping their employees. It sounds really futuristic and bizarre. And at first I wasn't gonna do it. And how much information did you have? Did you know that you could open doors? Sure, but how much information do you have about the chip in general? All of the questions that the news were asking, all the questions the employees were asking, all the right questions, uh, the nitty gritty questions were there. So I knew what it was made of, I knew what it could do, what it could do in the future. I was well educated before getting a microchip in my hand. They offered to take it out at the end of the day and I was like absolutely don't want this thing in my body longer than it needs to be and I'm kind of having second thoughts. I think I it might be fun to play around with it some more. I don't know, I'm having some, some thoughts, some inner conflicts about whether to keep it in or take it out.